We didn't see any issues during the launch of Challenger. It looked to us like we had a normal launch, a normal trip to orbit. Challenger, go with throttle up. Challenger, go with throttle up. Four of my astronaut classmates were killed, including Judy Resnick. And we were in the same class of astronauts, and her and I flew our rookie mission aboard Discovery two years earlier. So that was a very, very traumatic, traumatic event for, well, all astronauts, but certainly for my class of astronauts. The best we can do is remember our seven astronauts, our Challenger 7. Remember them as they lived, bringing life and love and joy to those who knew them and pride to a nation. Sometimes when we reach for the stars, we fall short, but we must pick ourselves up again and press on despite the pain. The Challenger accident happened in January of 1986. From there, it took us nearly three years to redesign and rebuild and recertify virtually everything on the entire space shuttle. The program was delayed two and a half years as they investigated how to fix the solid rocket booster. It was a failure of the O-rings that sealed these uh, booster rockets on uh, Challenger. So they had to come up with a fix for that. The shuttle, it was thought, would be a vehicle of aircraft-like qualities when it came to safety and reliability. So it was never designed in the operational phase to have any type of crew escape. The earlier rockets, uh, Neil Armstrong's Saturn rockets, the Mercury astronauts, they were protected with tractor rockets. They would pull the capsule away from a failing booster and the crews would be lowered to safety. Now after Challenger, NASA went back and tried to retrofit the shuttle with some type of viable escape system. And they gave us this um, bailout system, a backpack parachute. And to bail out of the shuttle, you had to go to the side hatch, jettison that, jump out. They did the best they could, and we were all looking forward to resuming flights after Challenger. None of us are ever going to forget the last words that came from Dick Scobie aboard Challenger, which was Roger Go at Throttle Up. And generally, those are the same words all of us used every time after that, because we launch, we throttle the three main engines down starting at 30 seconds, and then they throttle back up, and the call is always from mission control. Atlantis, Houston, your go at throttle level. 